Hey, what's up, everybody? So it's Rogue here playing Rune Factory once again for y'all. I'm feeling sick today, but that don't matter. I'm still here, still playing. And if you remember yesterday's episode, we beat the boss of the game. It was a very, very long battle that I had to cut down considerably. It turned it, made it, in, made it from a three-hour video to a hour and a half video. That's how long it took me to beat that guy. Because I am, I was sorely underleveled, so underleveled. Level 35. I'm supposed to be like around 50, 50-ish to beat him with a little less effort. And now, if uh, if I'm right, the only thing left to do is to level up, level up our villagers and choose who we want to spend the rest of our lives with. Right? So let's get out there. Oh, and today's the, uh... Oh, what's this? I guess my death strike is gone for good. What? Oh. I miss him, but he really battled heroically for us. He deserves a rest. I guess you're right. Thanks, my death strike, wherever you are. What? How am I supposed to level up my villagers if I can't go farm the items that they like? What the freak? Wait. Elena. Elena would know. Where's Elena? I was gonna say. Today is the, uh... Dragon Festival. As well. It's funny, because I couldn't have planned that if I tried. I go the wrong way. Yeah, I did. I couldn't have planned to beat the game right on the same day that the, the Dragon Festival is. I, I thought that was crazy. Oh, she's probably... Oh, shoot. She's probably not going to say anything because it's the festival. My golems are helping set the bonfire today. Yeah. She's talking about the festival. So... Let's see. I think... If I remember right, the only thing I get from this festival is just a, a sushi dish from Odette. And I think there's like points involved in completing festivals. So, I'm debating, should I just sleep it out and just skip it? Yeah. I'm gonna skip it. I want to talk to Elena about Mandat's drag. Wow, she's awake. It's interesting, she's never awake in the morning. So since we've beaten the game, it seems like everybody's schedules are a little bit different. Maybe not. Maybe not. It is a holiday. Maybe that's what it is. Just waiting for her to come out. Oh, there she is. Hey. Hey, look what I found. What is it? A rock? I think it might be a man a fragment of man death strike. I knew it. I knew she'd be hooking us up. Wow. So man death strike was shattered into a tiny pieces like that? That really is sad to think. Would you let me finish what I was saying? It might. It might be possible to be storm and that's right. Of course it is. What? what? Are you serious? Shut up already. I said might. Homes are created by magic and mechanics. In other words, they are built by people. So if we had the right clues, it's possible we could rebuild them. Well then let's do it. Yeah. Clear your jets. I said if we had clues. The clues are fragments like this. The more of them we get, the better our chances will be. You and an absolute genius like me would at least need ten, no, fifteen fragments. So all we have to do is collect the fifteen fragments? Mm. Right. Collect fifteen fragments and bring them to my place, and I'll see what I can do. I'll give you this one I found, so you know what you're looking for. Now go find the rest.
Okay, what does it look like? Um, is it not an inventory item? Oops, that's my alarm. Apparently it's not an inventory item, what the... Okay. So if it's not an inventory item, it's kind of like a... a special key item? Kind of thing? And... Since we can't leave the island, the fragments must be on the island. I wonder... If they're like scattered across the island, or... If... You know... 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I bet the villagers all have them. Oh. Hmm. What's up? Hey, so for reasons I cannot fathom, I feel drawn to this rock. My rock? It is just an ordinary rock that I would never notice along the path, yet there is something uncanny. It's actually a fragment of Mandestra. I see. That comports. Magic Dragon is a citizen of the island too. That must be why I felt such a strong affinity for this piece of rock. Sayo. In that case, this rock belongs to you, Azel. I return it now to a special moment. Thanks, Madonna. Okay, so the villagers have them. How strangely convenient, huh? <laughs> Just running around in my shorts. Never mind. I instantly changed out of my shorts. Oh, here we go. Uh, oh, Jet's on the move somewhere. Oh, hiya! Oh, he's so I found the craziest rock. <laughs> hey, that's a fragment for a man. That's right. It is. Guess it's your rock, then, soldier. May I? Go on, no problem. I bet he's right. But he's right. You can ask me anything. Hey. I know. I've been busy saving the world. Oh, I was just looking for you. I found this rock in front of your house. Did you drop it? That's just what we've been looking for. It's a fragment of my death strike. It is? Well then, I guess it belongs to you. Here you go. Is closed. We can get Lily's fragment somewhere. Maybe not. Where's Lily? Is she upstairs? I've never seen Lily upstairs before. Talk to you too. Shop is full of this normal stuff. Okay. They're both in the same room. I wish I could knock. Alright. Let's go up. Even though the, that this just happened, I bet they all have fragments. I heard that you were looking for rocks, so I did a little looking on my own. Is this what you wanted? <laughs> That's it. Thank you so much. That's a big help. I have small print to search also, so I ask her if she's found anything. Come on. You're looking for this, right? Take it. Jeez. So up front. A fragment of a death drag takes small print. But believe me, I didn't do it out of my any affection for you. Only because Lady Electra asked. I couldn't refuse. <laughs> well, thanks anyway. Oh. Oh, yeah. It's been ages. Just look at this rock I dug up. It looked like an ordinary rock, but I perceived a certain sparkle in it. Ace, hey, so does this rock have some connection with you? How'd you know? So this it was obvious. Is... I had a sparkle that reminded me of you. 
I don't know what you are up to, but I'm always on your side. Oh, okay. Didn't say that she was going to give it to us, but we got it anyway. Okay, so we're missing Violet, Lily, and Pandora, because they're unreachable. Sergeant Father Gerard told me. <laughs> he said you're looking for the shrub. So here, Kelsey and I each found one. Of course you did. Um, I found one too. Here. Thank you. Oh, that's that's Sonja. Sonja's body that's decomposing as we speak. It's weird to see my own body like this. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Tell me he's in his room. Come on. There you heard all about it to be sure. You're looking for rocks that are, will assist in the restoration of Mandat's drag, are you not? Would this be one of them? That, that, that's it. That's all. Thanks so much. <laughs> Think nothing of it. I'm sure I have you and Azel's eternal gratitude. I wouldn't say eternal. Just one of my amusing overstatements, you know. And I hope in that drag is fixed just as soon as can be. Five more. Okay. We'll go down here. Talk to Jacqueline. Okay. I discovered this rock. It looked like it had some special value from the moment I laid eyes on it. Right, it seems somehow calm. That's a fragment of Mandetta Drake. Would you be willing to give it to us? That's right. That's a Drake. What's the name of your goal? Wasn't it? So this is like part of your family. Please take it with my best wishes. Thank you. Konnichiwa. Oop. Joe's not here. Where'd Joe go? Oh, he's at the beach. You. I have a favor to ask. Yeah, what would that be? How can I turn down any request of yours? Look for rocks that look like this one. If you find one, already have it, lad. Hey, look. I spied that this were no ordinary rocks, so I took it and kept it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. So we got Joe, Pandora, Lily, and Violet. Where'd you go, Joe? Huh. Oh! Oh! Take a look at the same. That's. It was lying on the ocean floor near the island. It looked like any other chunk of rock, but I had a sense that it was, like, special somehow. Do you know what it is? Oh. Yeah, I do. It's a fragment of man, that's right. Oh. It's all yours then, bro. <laughs> I feel bad. <laughs> no bro. Take it. Yeah. Oh, I forgot James, too. Hey, listen, I've been looking at a bro for you. I wanted to give you the suit. Isn't that a fragment of an So then, Exactly. I heard from Elena that you were searching for them. I would like to help in some small way. After all, you, you have done so much for me. Thanks so much. <laughs> it's really nothing. When well, compared to what you did to save our island from peril, this is trifling. There's more villagers than there are stone fragments. Makes me wonder. Can we get more than one stone fragment? I mean, more than 15 stone fragments. Lily's on the move. Violet's still in the inn. Pandora's up there.
Oh, there's Scarlet. Hazel. For some reason, I feel like I should give this to you. Here. This is my moment. I think we've been looking for these. I'm glad to be able to make you happy. Okay, well, let me see if I can get more than 15. By talking to Lily. Whoops. Lily is probably going to end up in the church area. Right? No? Oh, she went to the dragon shrine. Either she's going to give me another, or nothing at all. We're looking for fragments of Indetra. Have you seen any rocks that look like this? I have one like that. For some reason, I don't know why, I felt drawn to it, so I picked it up, so it came. So it came from poor man Dancer Drag. Now it all makes sense. I guess this belongs to you, then. Here, I'll give it back. I can't get more than 15. Nice. Let's get them all, then. Um... Pandora? Is Pandora the last person? No. Still have to talk to Bismarck. So Pandora and Bismarck. If anything special comes from us getting more than 15. Hey! This rock is yours, of course. How'd you know that? Are you afraid of who I am? The power I sense in this rock is that of your polo. What a dull witted oaf you are to think that I would be able to, I would not be able to discern something so simple. Your golem is vital to this. To something. I press the button too fast to read. <laughs> Alright. Now, lastly, this part. Oh, it's such a pretty day. Yeah. This part. We're looking for rocks like this. Look familiar? As a matter of fact, I have one. Really? I just felt I couldn't just leave it there, so I... But of course, if you need it, Sonja, I'll give it to you. Please help me. And then, no, 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 no problem. And that's it. The only other fragment we could possibly get is from the delivery girl who delivers mail every month. Well, I'm not going to wait a whole month. just to get 19. So let's see what Elena has to say about us getting so many fragments. They're in the freaking changing room. Wait. Yeah, we're in the changing room. Just speeding up time a little bit. There she is. You brought me 15 golden fragments. The more I have, the better the odds of success, so let me have all of them. Got it. Now I'll get to work. It'll take a while, so be patient. By taking a while, it'll probably take a day. <laughs> well, there's really nothing else we can do but go to bed at this point. Can't leave the island. What am I gonna do? Cook? I wonder if I can sleep in it. I've never tried to sleep in a bed that didn't belong to me. Just had a, 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 a notion to try this out. It's Makoto's bed. You can't sleep in somebody else's bed. An unused bed. Okay. I can't sleep in unused beds. 
sleep in that one. That's cool. Wait, I don't want to get in trouble. I'll go home and sleep. Okay, that was stupid. That's extremely stupid. Well, that's bad. Odets. Lilies. Hmm. Well, let's, get, let's just go to bed. I'm wasting time. Oh. Good morning, Elena. Oi, oi. You're such a... Forget it, I'm used to it by now. What's up? <laughs> Do you realize what a genius you're dealing with? Soon you'll see it with your own eyes. Okay. Here we go. But He's back to the exact same way he was. <laughs> Welcome back. Good to have you back. <laughs> I better have to say. Let's see if we still have any of the same monsters inside. There they are. You guys got any gold for me? There you do. Okay. Now the fun part. Now that I can go anywhere I choose, first thing we're gonna do is level up all the villagers that are ready to level up. What time is it? 6 a.m.? Let's start with Odette because she's right here. Bathhouse party? I cancelled it. It would be a big pain to clean the bath afterward. So Melbourne was dead set against it. I can see why. I'd be opposed to it too if I were in her shoes. I'm actually really good at physical activities, especially swimming. Wanna race me sometime? Maybe she's not ready to level up. Veggies I bought were a little bit bruised. One thing that's unfortunate about Fenneth Islands is that fresh vegetables are hard to come by. I tried ordering from a different shop, but it seems like this box general store is the only way to go. Alright, guess she doesn't care. Yep. I'm a little jealous of the luxurious garden because it's so beautiful. Hmm. Oh. Oh, that's a long way of me. Let's Why are they not leveling up? So I had to go, <clears throat> excuse me, so I had to go, had to cut the video off, and now I'm cutting, uh, I'm cutting it back in, I had to leave, go to the doctor, come back, I've forgotten what I was doing, uh, did we, didn't we just get the golem fixed? Yeah, okay, got a golem back. Now, oh, and that's right, I was trying to level up my villagers and they're still not leveling up. Yeah, she's just like talking about the normal stuff, not leveling up, but the freak. I need to figure out why they're not leveling up. Because. Too, too much. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's look at the quest board. Oh, what? A gift of song, cooking to share, a flower to share. I have a present for everyone I call family. 
Alright, Lily. Oh, she disappeared already. Oh yeah, oh there you are. Hey. Yes, you can borrow me. Well. I want you to listen to a song. It's a song that holds a lot of memories for my sisters and also for the island. I'm sure it will hold a lot of memories for you too. Thank you for protecting everyone. We're so happy to have you here. Lily. I feel like it. I've had so much fun because of you two. I think of you both as my family. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to get all serious on you. Alright. I hate when I do that. Guess we'll do Odette next. I think she's in here. Aren't you in here, Odette? No, you're not. Where are you, Odette? You're in the bathhouse. That's annoying. Let's see, I wanna quick save it. Let's see who comes out first. Oh. Violet, of course Violet comes out first. Jeez, I should have picked a Violet's quest. Right, there you are. Oh, hi da, da, da. What's up? We're out of the quiet. Mm. I'm gonna talk to you. Come here for a minute. Food? Oi, oi. You call me in here just to cook? You know, I just... Though, I'd live my life cooking for my family and for all the guests here. But now I know that there are some things that need to be protected. Arigato. So I wanted to say thank you. I don't know what I would have done. What a, what would have happened without you two? Odette. This is a family recipe. It has a lot of memories for my sisters and I. S recipes? You're giving me the recipe. This is how family recipes are passed down. You're part of the family now. Alright, I'll try to make it. <laughs> Ultimate curry and kitchen recipes level S. Aha! Uh -huh. Just hang, hang back there a minute, Violet. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere silly. Okay. Well, Violet's the one that has the hots for us. Something fierce. Who knows what she's gonna have for us. Where'd you go? Oh, she went to the church. No, don't go inside! Ah! Morning. I have a flower I'd like to give you. Really? Yes. It's up in my room, so come with me. Hmm. Is that a special flower? My sisters and I planted this, and it's finally blooming. It's nice. If the world had ended back then, this flower would have never gotten a chance to bloom. I owe it all to you two. That's my alarm again. Thank you very much. It makes me feel a little awkward when you say it like that. I was just doing what I felt like I had to do. I wasn't trying to be a hero. But it's the truth, right? I hope that we can plant another flower with the whole family. Family. Of course, you live here. And now you feel like family. I'm sorry. That was awkward. No, it wasn't awkward. It was really sweet. Don't apologize. <laughs> I'm so glad. Hope you'll accept the flower from me. 
Oh, it's a pom pom flower. That's freaking um, Melpin's favorite flower. Oh, little does she know that the flower that she has given me will be given to her rival. Haha. <laughs> Alright, so now we have a couple of choices. Go, uh, go right to sleep and, uh, Go right to sleep, see what happens tomorrow, see if there's any new quests, or if I can level up the villagers yet. Or, hop on our golem, and race over to the, uh, where? The, what was it, the, the second shrine? Was it the fire shrine, or was it the earth shrine? I can't remember. Was it the earth shrine that I was, uh, I was, the, it's the shrine that I was farming those cloth. I want to. I want to guess it's this one. I'll know immediately. I'll just hop, we'll just get there, hit the second floor, and I'll know right away if it's the right place. Where is it? The third floor. Yes, this is the right place. This is where I want to farm a few cloths for Melpern. Oops. Man. I got these better weapons and everything, and they're just still not dying as fast as I'd like them to. I want them to die in like two hits, one hit. Guys aren't dropping very much crystals. I want to end up killing that. Uh... Whatever. I want to end up killing the spawn if I'm not careful. What the heck? Why aren't you guys dying easier, man? Die. They are not dropping jack squat for me right now, are they? Oh, there's a fun cloth, finally. They are not dropping nearly as many cloths as they used to. Yeah. Give me that, give me that, give me this. Give me that. I want to leave. I want to make a wish. <clears throat> Since Tyne's back, we can make wishes now, remember? So we're going to go make a wish to have the monsters drop more items. Just make an offering, a little bit of an offering, make a wish. Collect more items from defeated monsters. Yep. What's up, Tyan Jr.? How you doing, boy? When you defeat monsters, they will now be more likely to drop items. All right. What am I doing? There we go. It's too fast. It's too fast. Let's try this again. We're making a. We're we're doing a bit of an experiment here. Just how more likely are the items going to drop? Is it going to be a lot or not noticeable?
Already dropped one. Now. Where's another item? Oh, all three of you went down. Alright, looks like it's feeling better dropping items now. Fauna next to the spawner, god dang it. Ow, what the heck? Alright, that's a lot better. I'm getting tons of cloth now. Hey, I just I just literally hit you and you just ignored me? What the heck? No, don't hit the spawner. It's only 6 p.m. relax. I think that's good enough. He's running away from me. Wanker. Alright. We, we, uh, we spent some time getting some cloth from Elprin. And some sticks and stuff for Electra, because that's what she likes too. Maybe we can even give the proof of warrior to Kelsey. I'm sure he's got that. I'm sure that quest is still active. Is that it? Okay. Notice I just did enough farming till my RP got uh, depleted. All right. Let's go to the quest board and accidentally drink a potion for no reason. the quest bar and see about Kelsey. The book one. I'm looking for something I can't do. Please help. That's the one. That's the one he wants the uh, mask for. Hopefully they don't go to sleep before we make it to them. Stay awake, kids. Stay awake. Don't go to sleep yet. You are not tired. God dang it. Why do these kids fall asleep at 7 p.m.? What the hell is that? What's up with that? There's a dead body. Alright. So much for doing that Kelsey quest. Let's just go home, go to bed. Go home, go to bed. Anything happening today? Nothing. But uh, Warrior Festival is coming up. I remember the Warrior Festival sucked. No good prizes. Alright. Now, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, quest for it. Nothing. Nothing at all. Let's see if we can level her up. Oh. Okay. So, Mandat's Drag is restored. You have to tell me these things. Alright. Still not leveling up. This is not funny. This island has a lot of hills, doesn't it? So I'm wondering if that's the reason I tend to trip and fall sometime. I don't think so. Hang on. What's your favorite food? Ramen. 
Got it. He'll make it for you one of these days. Why are you gonna be so mean? What am I missing? I'm missing something. Let's go talk to everybody. Well, actually, let's mm, let's go on Mendez Drag, spend a little bit of time running around, then go talk to everybody. Just till like 9 p.m. when everybody's awake. <clears throat> Where should I go? Let's fill out the map. I don't waste plenty of time. Just filling out the map. Maybe there's an achievement for it. What is this? Jungle Island. Oh, I remember that. Alright, I've already filled out over here pretty much. Next would be over here, I guess. Um, where am I at? There I am. Let's just go to here. Or at least see if we can make it there. Alright, it's too late. Let's go back home. Now let's talk to everybody and see what's up, man. Why aren't you guys leveling up for me? Already talked to Lily. Let's go in here and talk to see if Bismarck or Elena's in here. Are they in here? Nobody's in here. Okay, never mind. Makoto is out here somewhere. Let's talk to Makoto. Makoto, where you at, bro? There you are, over there. By the lake. How's it going, Makoto? Makoto, it has been a while. But, but to to think it can be rebuilt after this. <laughs> what mysterious things gold are? I read in a book of a master swordsman who could get in three thrusts on one lunge. I tried to attempt it myself. <laughs> however, I am still far too unskilled. That's too bad, Makoto. Keep practicing. Yo. Yo. Hmm. What's that? Time? Yeah. But nice weather. I have the day off, and it would be nice to take a walk. Oy, oy. I always have free time. Mm. Here. That's fine. What do you think you're ugly? I've heard you are growing vegetables, so it's over. What do we do to not grow spinach? Amy, no spinach. Need to talk to Electra. She's they're closer, I think. Ooh. Electra and Bismarck. Let's talk to Bismarck. Talk. Welcome to the store. Making my deliveries is so much easier on these fine days, okay? Nothing. Oh, Electra's in the inn. Let's talk to Electra. Welcome. My uncle who lives in Cardia doesn't live with his daughter. He must be so lonely. But I know he does it for her sake. Okay. So far we're batting a hundred. Losses. Trying to figure out what what the holdup is with the, with our villagers leveling up. Uh Okay. Hope it'll be sunny again tomorrow. I suppose I have to occasionally act like a real mayor. There are times when I think, oh, what could happen if I didn't? And then I find myself in the garden before I know what happened. That's disturbing. I am looking mighty energetic. I'm half joking. I can't catch anything here. 
Facing the fish in Mortal Kombat and giving the battle all you've got, that's what fish is ought to be. Whatever you say, man. Oh. Alan is over at the beach with James. Konnichiwa. Right? I've always felt like this, but it takes too long for other towns by ship. Any chance you go up and ride your dragon? Mm. Hazel, please. Oy. Don't even think about it. Why not, man? You can let him ride the dragon. The question is, will the dragon let him ride? Hey there. Small crystals. I don't have enough small crystals. Give me some if you have any. You really think you're a genius, don't you? <laughs> yep, I am after all. Sometimes I wake up from when I realize something. Realize this morning. You've done it before too, right? Right? No. Nothing. Nothing came from us. From any of. So far, nothing has come from talking to these villagers. No clues. Nothing. Better go get to Kelsey before he goes to sleep. Hey. Where is it? There you go. Thanks for the pepper. It's a weird weapon. Look, I got a bug. Haha. -ha. I got a letter from my friend. Writing letters is so much fun. Hello there. Can you advise me? No. I think of you both as my children, so please don't hesitate to come to me if you ever need advice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Minions, you came at just the right moment. I have an assignment for you. Better not be another weird job. Of course not, it's weird. Of course it's not weird. It's in fact easy enough even a dough widow oaf like you can do it. Take this ancient tome to Lily. No reward will be paid. Well, for such a small task, I guess that's fine. Go then immediately! Okay. I wish I had talked to her first. God dang it. Where's Lily at? Is she in the inn? Yes, she is. Oh, ah, dang it. I hate when I do that. Lily! This is from Pandora. She told me to give it to you. I can't believe she made you bring it to me. That Pandora. What? Some time ago, right around the time you came to Fennel Island, I heard a story from a customer. There was once a little girl who lived all alone. Because she was lonely, she split into two in order to have someone to talk to. Later on, the two girls made many friends. Thanks for their friendships with these people, the girls were able to merge back into one person. A person who split into two people and then merged into one? What a weird story. Oh! That's right. The story contains a hint about how you two can get back to normal. According to the, my customer, the girls' friendships were transformed into the power to restore them by a spirit song. If we can do the opposite, we can get back to normal? Exactly. Great! I can finally get back into my body! How does a spirit song transform friendships into power? For that we need this ancient tome. It contains the method. I wonder what it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Very interesting. Are you gonna tell us? Oh, I'm sorry. According to the ancient tome, a thing called the friendship compass will let you know what degree of friendship you have with those around you. Have you ever heard of that, Hazel? No? Have you? No. Maybe because maybe Bacchus would know. Good idea. Let's talk to Bacchus about the friendship compass. Why would Bacchus know? Wait, was he inside? Of course it was. We're looking for something called the friendship compass. Friendship compass. Friendship compass. Friendship compass. Friendship. Uh, rings a bell. Oh, I remember. A while ago, Joe said he had found a treasure that baffled him. He asked Jacqueline to take a look at it. She said that she knew all about it. It's called the Friendship Compass. You should ask Joe. Okay. 
Why don't we go ask Joe about it? Where's Joe at? Joe's not here. That means we're going straight to bed. Wrong way. Come on, Joe. Seriously, what do you know? Ah, uh, he's never asleep at six. God dang. I've lost track of how many times I came to see Joe. He's never asleep at seven. I mean six. Come on out, fool. Are you not coming out? Okay. Oh my god. Serious? Ah, uh, really? Ooh. Hey, you suck. Ja. Why are you sleeping so much? Bacchus told us that you have a friendship, a treasure called the Friendship Compass. Ooh. Yeah, I got it, but I have no clue what it's supposed to be used for. Would you be willing to give it to me? That's an unusual request from you, man. Ooh. I don't mind, but tell me, did you find something out about the Friendship Compass? Hey, can we turn this to normal? Mm -hmm. Really? I'd do anything to help with that. I think the friendship compass is in my room somewhere. I'll look around for it. So come back tomorrow and I should have it. Oh. Aww. Come back tomorrow. Come back tomorrow, he says. I bet he's still sleeping at 6 a.m. Alright. Whoops, wrong button. Yep, they're still sleeping, so we're gonna stand here for an hour. Oh, um. <sighs> there you are, you little schmuck. Oh, Yo, brought you the friendship compass, man. <laughs> Hope you can get back to normal soon. Thanks. And what do I do with it? Go back to Lily, maybe? Where's Lily? She's on the move. Where is she, though? Did she go that way? Is she already gone? She's somewhere. Maybe she's over here? Where'd she go? Okay, so she went up north. Let me load it. So she's behind us? I don't see her though. There you are. Hmm. Looks like you found the friendship compass. <laughs> Thanks to the clue you provided. Let me explain how to use it. The friendship compass is a tool that will let you... will tell you the degree of friendship you have with the people around you. Give the friendship compass as an offering on the altar of the dragon shrine. If your friendships are deep enough, the dial will light up. If all the marks on the dial light up, it means the friendship compass has accumulated enough power. Then bring the friendship compass to me. Whoops! <laughs> I'm glad I saved it. Glad I saved it. Talk to you again. Okay. Alright. So we take it to the Dragon Shrine. This is quite the end game for a game that I already supposedly beat the final boss with. Check friendship compass. All 12 marks are lit up. Yep. Let's take it to Lily. Alright. 
That was easy. I didn't have to do any extra work because I had already done all the work Where earlier. Where are you at, Lily? You're in the bat. I swear to God, this game is pissing me off at this point. Come on, man. Oh, all right. She came right out. All the marks on the compass are lit up. Hold on, let's begin. Hazel, so you and Sonja go to where Sonja's body is. I'll be there right away with Odette. There it is, the body that has been decaying for the last five days. <laughs> you'll finally be able to, you'll finally be restored to your own body. That's great. It really is great. Before we begin, I want to confirm one thing with you. Once you are, once you two are separate people, the power you have obtained, the power to command Mandat's drag, to battle monsters, and so on. This power will be given to either Azel or Sonja. The one who does not receive the powers will lose them, but whatever powers you originally will not be lost, and you will be the same as ever. This is a momentous decision, so consider carefully. There is no going back. <clears throat> Whom do you wish to receive the power? Azel or Sonja? Obviously. Azel. <clears throat> is everyone ready then? Let's begin. <clears throat> okay. Right. Here we go. Is it me or is every spirit song the same? <laughs> What's up? What's up, Soja? I'm sorry, I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, you are. That's right. Thanks, everybody. Oh, boy. I just thought about something now that we're separate and bodies, and we have to rethink our living situation. Not really. You're right, we can't keep on living together. Uh, Are there any other vacant houses on the island? Yes, there is. Uh, what should we do? Well, you can come to our inn. We have an open room. You can live there. We won't charge you. You can work part-time instead. <laughs> really? That's great. And so that's no problem. Think of it as a gift to celebrate Sonja's restoration. So which one of you will move to the inn? I'll go. I'm not cut out for the forging and stuff. Okay, now Sonja, we can work together and decorate your room. You must be tired, Azel. Why don't you rest today? Oh. Yeah. Oh, well, looks like I rested. And it's the Warrior Festival. Sonja's not there, buddy. Oh, yeah! So I'm just back in her own body. <laughs> Certainly makes things quieter. Mm. Today's the Warrior Festival. Boom! Save. Now Soldier's in our... What level is her friendship? At? Eight and a heart? Great. Just great. <laughs> that just means I have work to do with uh, with Melbourne. Uh, and I have to... Uh, well... Hmm. Mm. I'm deciding what I want to do about this. I'll focus on the other villagers before I level up Sonja. We'll wait on Sonja. We'll wait for the others to get to level 8. Now, uh, this video took a lot longer than I expected it to. So I'm going to go ahead and end it here, and then the next time, tomorrow, it'll just be us hopefully leveling everybody up. But hold on, let me save it real quick.
I already saved it. Let me save it real quick again. Hold on. I want to go talk to somebody. Oh, it's a festival today. Hold on. <laughs> Let me go to bed real quick. We're testing out to see if I can level them up yet. Oh, there's another festival today. What? Why is there another festival today? Okay. Okay, where is everybody? Let's see if Odette levels up. Perfect, do you have a minute? Alright, good. That means I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Tomorrow, or the next time I post Rune Factory video, we'll be leveling up all the villagers. Finally. Peace.